I got that. Feeding time with our sea lions gives the keeper a chance to work on training, which is a very important part of how we care for our animals. Don't worry if some of the animals decide to skip a meal. Sometimes they are just not hungry, and our sea lions never have to worry about when their next meal will arrive. Young pups do not eat fish. Because they are mammals, sea lions nurse their young, and if any of our pups are still nursing, you may see this shortly after the females finish their meal. We do sea lion training for oh, many reasons. It gives us oh, an yeah, opportunity to get close it's to our pet animals that's and the monitor one. their physical health. Training is also important for their mental health, as it gives the sea lion tasks to do and challenges to think about. By training the sea lions to station themselves in different areas of the pool and feed, keepers are able to make sure everyone gets their share. They watch what each animal eats and exactly how much. And having the sea lions comfortable with this routine can also help in case we ever need to give one of them medication. In the wild, sea lions feed on squid, octopus, herring, sardines, and other fish. Here we feed them herring and capelin, which the sea lions will usually swallow whole and head first. Each sea lion eats from 6 to 35 pounds of fish a day. The amount of meat depends on the individual, with bigger sea lions eating more, and depends on the season. Sea lions eat more during the fall, so they gain weight and blubber for the cold winter ahead. Sea lions are very intelligent and capable of learning a variety of behaviors. We work on training a combination of natural behavior and husbandry behaviors. Natural behaviors include anything that the sea lion may do in the wild, such as vocalizing or diving. Husbandry behaviors include activities that allow keepers to manage, position, and examine the sea lions. Opening their mouth, raising a flipper, or laying down on the beach are all behaviors that help us get a better look at the sea lions 
to make sure that they stay in good health. You may even see the keepers practicing other medical behaviors, like ultrasounds or injection training for vaccines. Some behaviors are more about having fun and are designed to further challenge the sea lions to think and act. I love the sea lions are naturally class. curious and playful, so the keepers may also use items like balls and tubes during the training She's session. She's got so many different hand signals. Today, thing knows. California sea lion populations in the wild are stable. But there are other sea lion species that are in trouble, and marine mammals in general could use our help. The Wildlife Conservation Society is working to save wildlife and wild places around the world. One way you can help marine mammals, like sea lions, is to be aware of the fish and seafood that you are eating. Make wise choices that will be less harmful to ocean wildlife. To learn more, visit us online at wcs.org. We hope you have enjoyed your time with the sea lions. Thank you for visiting with us today. And we look forward to seeing you back again soon. So cool, right? Right? <laughs> and we literally got here. They're like, welcome. Oh. Yeah, that's what we heard all night when we were in Big Sur. Wow. He's corralling them. Look okay. at Oh, the little one. Oh, he's coming back for the little one. <laughs> Is it a baby? I feel bad for it. Is it her? Perfect timing. We got here like right in the best spot. Okay, oh, that was excellent. I think this is just like they're like wherever, you know? It's just they come out and really are interactive to be feeding. Yeah, yeah, they're always out, but you get to see the tricks and stuff.